Naughty Dog teases more multiplayer games, The Last of Us. New job listings suggest that Naughty Dog's efforts to enter the multiplayer realm might extend beyond factions. Eagle-eyed fans have spotted that The Last of Us team is hiring for a new associate multiplayer quality assurance tester slash development support, and the listing asks for someone who will be working on multiplayer titles. Interesting use of plurals, there. Fans have taken this to mean that Naughty Dog is on top of another multiplayer project already either that or it's trying to future-proof factions, meaning that we'll get more content for the game post-launch. If there are more multiplayer games on the way, who knows what they could be. The developer is seemingly done with Uncharted, so don't expect a Nathan Drake-inspired factions. Before you get too excited, there's something in the way. The job role might imply something exciting for the future of Naughty Dog's multiplayer games, but the position application mentions that it is for a temporary engagement through our staffing partner DeesConX. With this in mind, the successful candidate could be assigned to work on factions alone, without any focus on the future of multiplayer games for the company. There are also sure to be grumbles about a push into multiplayer when we're dying for more information on a mythical The Last of Us Part 3. On The Last of Us Day 2019, Naughty Dog revealed that the multiplayer mode originally intended for The Last of Us Part 2 had grown in scope beyond what was feasible to bundle with the game and that they had made the decision to launch Part 2 without a multiplayer mode. Naughty Dog went on to say, you will eventually experience the fruits of our team's online ambition. When and where it will be realized is still to be determined. At Summer Game Fest 2022, Neil Druckmann confirmed that the game would be a standalone title that will be just as big as any of Naughty Dog's single-player games. It will feature unique story elements with brand new characters located in San Francisco, California. He shares a picture of concept art featuring two armed survivors on a rooftop, in the background is the Bay Bridge and south of Market, as what appears to be a storm of dust and flying debris blankets the city. On the ground below them are other survivors fighting off infected. Druckmann continued to reveal that Naughty Dog veterans Vinit Agarwal, Anthony Newman, and Joseph Padinati are helming the project. He ended by saying, you'll hear a lot more about this game next year. In a blog posted by Naughty Dog the same day, the game is described as having a massive scope and immense world, while their aim is to make the game inviting to new players while still keeping a thrilling challenge for more of their seasoned fans.